percent Lakota schools return to class next month. We'll have an extra layer of protection. Nine on your side's Tamika Arnis is live now at Lakota West to explain the district's decision and the reason behind the change. Tamika. Catherine, a Lakota West High School is one of nearly uh, two dozen uh, school buildings here in this district. And in fact, as you mentioned, uh, Butler, uh, this is actually the largest school district in Butler. And so with 17, nearly 17,000 students, uh, safety district officials say is a top priority for everyone. Uh, in light of all the recent school shootings and attacks happening across the country, these new officers will be supplied by the Westchester Police and Butler County Sheriff's Departments, and yes, they will be armed. Here is what we know so far. Eight school resource officers will be hired starting with this coming school year, and that will nearly double the force, bringing the total number of armed officers at Lakota schools to 18, and they will be tasked with patrolling all 23 buildings in the district. Uh, this is such an important issue. There's even been some talk of actually arming trained staff members at Butler County Schools nearby. Uh, nothing has been decided yet on that topic, but obviously something that a lot of parents and students are concerned with. I'd like to hear your thoughts. We have an article right now on my Facebook page. You can go on there and chime in with your opinions right now. And let me know what you think about this uh, very important topic. Reporting live this morning, I'm Tamika Artis 9 on your side.